what's hiding in this mystery speaker. Looks extra old, it doesn't have any sort of brand or anything on it. There's fancy holes on the back. I guess the first thing to do is just carefully remove this grill without damaging the speaker. It's the best way to carefully remove something. Extra tough, spitting up dust. Come on! Ooh, it's got the pillow inside. Ugh, yuck. Big fancy oval speaker. Surprised there's no bugs in here. This thing's just so stubborn. Finally, I can avoid all these staples. Interesting design. I'm sure you can read the back because it's in 4K. That's all it says, it's just a bunch of numbers. No brand on it. Throwing around is the best way to disassemble the speaker cabinets. Just falls right apart. See? Is that just sitting in there? How cheap. Oh, it's just glued on. Great quality. Better see how these do on the outlet. Speakers are all wired up and ready to speak. Has to be on the outlet like usual. Oh, that was weak. Here's a close-up for those that just have to see it. I don't understand why it's got this other input here when it's all connected here. And as you can see on the speaker, it has the two sets of wiring going to the one speaker. I don't know how that works. And there's the numbers. I'm sure someone can decode all this. So fun, always blowing out speakers through the outlets because it does nothing. What did I know it is vintage? Better have all that copper wiring in there. Oh, it's all trapped in there. I'm sure I had the bajillion dollars worth of copper. So rattly now. Audio clarity! Did little tweeter say anything? Nope. That's it for the mystery speaker. Still a mystery.